Hey y'all, welcome, welcome back. Uh, my name is Lakeisha. If this is your first time here, welcome. I am here on purpose for his glory and so are you. So I wanted to jump on here um, again really quick and share something that I'm feeling glad to share with you guys. So um, as you guys know, I just posted uh, two videos today in regards to December 23rd and um a sister in Christ had commented on the video and she said uh, the Lord has revealed to me that the wealth transfer will happen before Christmas I asked the Lord about Sheba and God said this week he said Sheba 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 and told me buy more something will happen either tonight or tomorrow which is 12 22 2023 or 12 23 2023 something will happen either tonight or tomorrow for sure there's a blackout coming and god wants people to stock up on food and water and what's um very interesting about that is uh god has been telling me about the blackouts for a couple of years now and i actually released a video a few months ago um, i think it's titled the blackouts will pass over your home or something like that she goes to say that um, the blackouts will be the reason for the transfer, for the wealth transfer. And I was like, that's pretty interesting because um, on 12-8-2023, I heard a cyber attack for wealth transfer to happen. And, you know, I'm like, okay, but I didn't receive anything else on it. But after the sister in Christ just said that, you know, the Lord revealed to her that the transfer would happen um, through a blackout, I'm like, I wonder if that has something to do with that prophetic word I had received. And then she commented back and she said that, um, you know, basically, yes, uh, the cyber attacks will cause the blackouts. And so I Google to see, you know, if cyber attacks could cause a blackout. And the short answer is yes. Um, I went to her channel, check out a few videos um, that she has released. And um, lo and behold, you guys, the God has, God has been telling her the same things that he's been telling me. So that's more confirmation and... Um, our spirits are definitely in alignment um so with that the lord wants me to let you guys know to also read psalms 91 and remember though a thousand may fall at your side ten thousand at your other side you know uh nothing will touch you nothing will harm you god is with us and he has his angels watching over us and um the blackouts, like I said, um, in the video that I had posted about the blackouts, one of the videos, the blackouts will pass over our homes. We will just watch as Psalms 91 says, as God judges the wicked, nothing will touch us. So be encouraged, um, stay prayed up, stay covered in the blood, keep your eyes on Jesus, the author and the perfecter of our faith. Um, no matter what is going on around us, we are safe in God's arms and he is our protector and we're all good. We're all good in the mighty name of Jesus. So I just wanted to let you guys know this. So in the case um, this does take place, um, you guys are not, you know, caught by surprise. So uh, take this word back to the Lord for your own confirmations. Um, remember to meditate and read on Psalms uh, 91 and just keep your eyes focused on Jesus and remember that God is in control of all of this and um, nothing can happen without God's permission and so that's that if Holy Spirit has laid it upon your heart to sow a love gift this is a fertile ground to sow seed into and I pray that God blesses you back a hundredfold, a thousandfold in the mighty name of Jesus. If you've been led to sow, please come back to share your testimony 
of God's goodness to those who sow on fertile ground with a cheerful heart. Taken from 2 Corinthians 9, 6 through 7. Please consider becoming a part of the family. Like and share this video with someone else. As always, I love you guys with the love of Christ. And remember that God loves you more. Until next time, you guys stay blessed and shalom.